I'm Mishkin, and you're watching The Portland Pick. When we resurface. Portland, this is Yuri with The Portland Pick. I'm sitting here in Al's Den with Mishkin. Mishkin's got a pretty interesting story, and I really want to hear about it. I read about it online, online a little bit, but you have a pretty a, a long story. It's, it's that, long. Yeah, it's well, let's, long let's get into it. Let's get into it. Um... I don't know. I've been singing since I can remember, but I landed in New Orleans in 1993. 1993, okay. Yes. And um, I spent nine by years a few there. Years, right? <laughs> I, can't, I moved to Portland in, in 2002. 2002. Okay, that's where that number came from. Yeah. Okay. So, um, yeah, and during the New Orleans years, I was uh, playing a ridiculous amount of like 300 shows a year. Wow, crazy, every, almost every day. Constant, almost every day. Were you were you under the name Michigan then too? Or? Yeah, and okay. I had a duo, and then I had a band. Well, I, first I had a band called Michigan Impossible. Okay. And then I had a <laughs> I like duo it. for a long time with um, songwriter Mike West. Okay. And then um, I had a band called Michigan's Ruby Warblers, which continues today, yeah. although it has been through many permutations and it's now kind of a fluid concept. Okay, what do you mean by that, by a fluid concept? Um, I really love to collaborate and I really love, uh, I have, feel very lucky that I know lots of great musicians and I, they're kind of stashed all over the world in different places and so um, I try and, you know, just play with them when I'm near them and get little bits of recordings and stitch them together into records and okay so yeah. uh, i just want to know the name michigan where did that come from what the was name that idea? the name michigan comes from a dostoevsky novel okay. called the idiot the idiot yes. okay and um i took it because it's a it's a character that's um it that's he's kind of all of he's kind of all about innocence and and honesty like he's too honest for his own okay. good and i took it as a way to remind myself to stay honest in my work Okay. All right. Cool. What about recorded music? What do you have? What do you have on the on the table for for your fans when it comes to recording music? I've got a bunch of records. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> the latest one, it, it's either seventh or ninth or tenth, depending on what you count. But it's um. You count them all. I, yeah. I, yeah. Anything you remember, right? <laughs> <laughs> you made a CD. <laughs> it's and it's uh it's called that Diamond Lust. Yeah. And it took forever to make because I made it. I started it in Portland. Okay. And then I moved down to the mountains and um built that studio which takes a long time mm -hmm. then um, I finished it two years ago put it out last year okay and, and it has more of that electro it does feel, yeah, yeah yeah I started it I started working on it with um, Sugar Shortwave and um, and then I went actually went to New Orleans on a visit and collected a bunch of tracks there from, mm -hmm. from friends there and then from some other great Portland musicians Heather Perkins and um, Paul Evans Jesse Brook here uh -huh. in Portland Okay, and, and uh, the War Blues are basically just just people that you know that are in music that will collaborate with you. There's At no this point, set. Yeah, yeah there's really you, no. It, I mean, it started out as a set band. Yeah, but there is no set band. Since I, I moved to the woods, there's no. Set are you band. going to keep that? Are you going to keep that up coming in in the near future? Go, going on? I don't know. I mean, is, is I mean, it working though? Having different people on your music all the time. I mean, it's working for me right now okay. because I don't. I, I live in the woods, yeah. <laughs> and it, so I've kind of don't. I'm not, not surrounded by musicians, and it's it's a hard place to live and keep a band together. Um, mm. And and I actually I took a big break from touring and from music for a couple mm. years while I was building and. Um, yeah, you really haven't been around much. I haven't been around yeah. much, and so I'm just just in the last year I've been touring again. Where can we, when, where can people find you online? Michigan's Ruby Warblers .com. Okay. Michigan's Ruby Warblers. Ruby Warblers dot com. com. For more info. All right. So, guys, thanks for watching the Portland Pick. This is Michigan. We're at Al's Den in uh, Southwest Portland. Michigan Warblers dot com for more info. Michigan's Ruby Warblers. Oh, sorry, sorry. Michigan's Ruby Warblers <laughs> dot com. That's what it is. So, see you guys later. Thanks, Yuri. Love you where you are.